same day they pay. Yeah, yeah. Bad bitch, no underwear. 2020 gon' pull up an egg, yeah. Bitch, I know where you can go home. Uber, Uber everywhere, yeah. Take my bitch everywhere. We be getting money everywhere, yeah. They don't even know. They be throwing shade everywhere. and I am back with another video. This one is about my hair. <laughs> I feel like my channel is slowly turning into a hair channel, but this one's about my hair. I took my locks out and I colored it in this really cute, like reddish, auburn type color that I'm just like falling in love with. Um, so if you wanna see how I got it, then keep on watching. So I love this color, but I definitely was going for more of like a gingery scissor type color and that was a complete fail uh so this video will also be about how to go ginger without making the mistakes that i made um so if you're interested in that then keep on watching okay so i started off on previously deep conditioned conditioned and shampooed hair just because my hair was in a protective style i sectioned it and then i started to apply the bleach so I used the L'Oreal Quick Blue Bleach, which is my favorite. I feel like it instantly tones the hair, so you don't need to do a lot after it. So I used 40 volume developer, and I was supposed to use 20 volume, but here's what happened. So I used 40 on my ends, because my ends had previously been blonde a long time ago. Um, and then I let that sit for about 10 minutes. So after I let that sit for 10 minutes, it was very clearly already lightening. So I put that same 40 developer volume mixture on my roots and that was my gigantic mistake. So I put it on my roots and I let it sit for 15 minutes. Now it was a mistake because my roots, my poor little babies, they got so bleached. Not that they got damaged or anything, but um, wow, they were like white. I feel like I couldn't even see my hairline. I was like, oh no, the follicles, they're bleached. So, um, what I would recommend in this instant is to do what I should have done, which was just do the 20 volume developer on my roots for not even for 15 minutes, maybe for about 10. So after the bleaching process was finished, I then decided to, after I rinsed the hair out, I put a deep conditioner on it for maybe about 30 minutes just while I grabbed some food just to sort of make sure that my hair was okay because obviously after you bleach, it's very dry and sort of like, it's just not cute. So after that debacle, I was like, it's fine, it's not a problem, I'm just going to move forward to the semi-permanent dye. So I ended up using um, Cajun Spice and Cinnamon. I mixed them all together with a very, very small amount of conditioner, and then I just started putting it all over my head. So I figured that because my hair color wasn't even, that it wouldn't give me and even coloring but I didn't anticipate the way that it was gonna look on my roots so once I put that semi-permanent color in I let it sit for about 30 minutes and it definitely colored the ends of my hair or the majority of my hair the way that I wanted to that was the color I was going for I was kind of hyped I was excited but it just the roots didn't look good and I was really sloppy so uh, after that process actually I just went to sleep because I was done I was like I put my hair through enough this is supposed to be the final step and it's not uh, so then I woke up in the morning and went to the store and got a box dye the box dye that I got was a light auburn color so I concentrated it all in my roots and then I just put what was left over my hair and the way that I applied it was like making sure that when my hair was pulled back that it was you know all one color and then in the back I did that same sort of thing um so I let that sit for about 30 minutes like it says and then yeah I rinsed her out I put a little bit of deep conditioner on her but not much 
Um, and then I blow dried my hair and I straightened it and I did a little bump and curl and this is what I ended up with. I'm super happy with this color actually. I definitely wanted that ginger orange type of thing that's so popular right now and cute but I, I got a reddish color instead and I'm really feeling it. I'm also feeling my eyebrows like. I did them kind of reddish also yeah those are my words of advice that was my that was my process I hope that this video was helpful I hope you really like this video uh, like subscribe comment all of that